The success of the U.S. Department of Energy's National Clean Fleets partnership can be seen on the highways and byways of our nation's roads. Fleet partners like PepsiCo's Frito-Lay division, FedEx, Staples, and Coca-Cola are working hard to reduce their reliance on imported oil and improve efficiency by merging alternative fuel technology into their fleets. One truck maker that's had a big hand in developing petroleum-free commercial transportation is Smith Electric Vehicles in Kansas City, Missouri. This sprawling 80,000 square foot factory has been transformed into an EV utopia. The production line includes areas you don't typically see like battery assembly. But rest assured, workers here are building a world-class product. The very first day when we hired our first eight um, senior leaders for this factory, I said best truck in the world. Not the best electric truck, best truck in the world. So that was the goal. Smith CEO Brian Hansel says the company's vehicle designs draw upon 80 years of market knowledge. Smith is a well-known name in England where they hand-built all electric milk delivery trucks for decades. It's a staple in, in the UK as a vehicle of choice for dairy delivery for the last you know, 50 years. They hope to build that same name recognition here in the States with their durable all-electric Newton Classic model. With no engine noise, no tailpipe emissions, and a driving range of up to 150 miles on a single charge, it's the ideal solution for company fleets with predictable delivery routes. We believe this is the future. There, there's no doubt. It, it makes economic sense, it makes environmental sense, it just is the right application for this. Plant manager Bob Lucas says the vehicles can be upfitted in a variety of ways, including this Newton school bus. Other customizations include assembled lithium-ion battery packs based on driving needs. Lucas, who played an integral role in getting the U.S. factory up and running, says the Smith Electric vehicle is a big rolling computer with very few moving parts. If you compare it to a diesel, a diesel mechanical system, the drivetrain has about 1,300 moving parts. Our vehicle is nine. Every aspect of vehicle production is done with meticulous precision. Smith uses a state-of-the-art computer software program that lists work order instructions sequentially, leaving little room for error. But I've been in this field for almost going on 10 years now working with the Atlas Copco system, and it's, this is really neat. I'm really excited for this. Every Smith vehicle goes through a rigorous, and I mean rigorous, test and validate process to make sure they're safe and roadworthy. When you're building up a brand and putting out a new product, Lucas says it's important to get it right. We know that we are pioneering this, and we represent not just Smith Electric Vehicles, but we represent the whole electric vehicles industry, and we want to see the electric vehicles industry succeed. With more than 300 units manufactured at this Kansas City plant in just the past three years, Smith Electric is charged up about their future. In fact, FedEx will soon add Smith's Newton step van to their fleet, further promoting the benefits of electrification. If you think about these type of brands and how important they realize their role is, um, they do understand, I think, are embracing the fact that we are creating an industry here and, and they want to take a, a proactive role in that. Hansel would like to see more companies jump on the electrified transportation bandwagon. An investment in this type of alternative technology would be a boon to the National Clean Fleet's partnership and Smith Electric. As a company, we're, we're just putting our toe in the water, but we happen to have the right customers and, and we definitely see a very bright future.